Well, thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. All right, first of all, tell us about eczema and what it is, how common it is. So eczema, like you already mentioned, is uh -huh. very common in the pediatric population as well as in the adult population. And so if 15 million U.S. people have this condition, mm -hmm. you can imagine how difficult it can be, and it can range anywhere from mild to severe. So it's a, a layer of outer skin that's really itchy and dry? So what it, what it is is a leaky outer layer of skin, which then allows irritants and allergens to go through, causing inflammation. Huh. And the red rash can actually lead to many sleepless nights, and a lot of people are very self-conscious about how this rash appears. Look at it. We see pictures here of how it presents itself in, in several different people, which leads to, I guess, depression because especially in kids, they look different and they don't want to look different. Right. So a recent survey in the National Eczema Association showed that 30 percent of people with atopic dermatitis or otherwise known as eczema have underlying depression and anxiety. So when you're treating someone with eczema, do you have to put all this into consideration? So I think that hearing this information should push doctors to more aggressively treat the eczema because treating the eczema actually improves the depression and anxiety. Hmm. The good news is there's a lot of new medications that have come out recently that actually are good options for treating eczema. With no side effects or, 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 or do they each come with a risk? I mean, every medication yeah. is different. Most recently, one that's come out is called Dupilumab, and it's actually an injection that has had excellent results in treating people with eczema. Interesting. How quickly does it clear up? Because if, if we saw the pictures of what it looks like um, and it is miserable. How quickly after these medications do they get results? I mean, everybody's different, but pretty quickly. I mean, using a medication that's an injection like Dupilumab, within a few injections, most people have had success. And in my personal clinic, I've had excellent results as well. Right, within weeks? Within weeks. Oh, perfect. Uh, what's your advice to someone if, you, if you, they're suffering depression? Should they, I guess they should always get help if they feel like they feel that bad, but... Exactly, and I think it's also up to the physician to also screen these patients who have underlying eczema because 30% of them do have this mental health burden that I think if we're screening people properly for this, we're identifying it more and it could be life-changing if we catch it early. It could be anywhere. It could be on your face. It could be on your chest, your arms, your legs. Yes, and you can imagine it's always itchy. Mm -hmm. And so you're not sleeping and you're feeling miserable about it and you're having all these allergies that really identifying the depression part of it can actually make yeah. things better. Well, maybe people can inquire about the new medication and even the injections to exactly. try to help. Exactly. Thanks, Dr. Rena Mehta. Thank you for having me. Appreciate it. Time now for a check of the forecast.